All right, uh, I got a package in the mail today. Um, it is from Fracture. These are the wonderful people um, headquartered in Gainesville, Florida that will print your photos onto glass. Um, I just cut open the box and decided to do a little unboxing video of our award-winning photos. So these are the photos from the fall that um, scored very highly in the uh, UNF physics photo contest. And, um, we had a winning photo get first place, uh, but unfortunately it did not fit onto a fracture, so that one is not included in this set. Um, but these will be going up in our classrooms. Oh, um, your walls are going to love this. Yes, they are. So all we have to do is cut lift and hang. I'll be doing the first two parts. I'll be asking Physical Plant to, be, to do that third part. Um, they have a 100% happiness guarantee, so that's nice. So we look in here, um, we see why the fracture medium is so cool, um, because these photos look so amazing. Um, let's see, I need to cut along this part here. There we go. All right, so that frees this part here, freeze this here. Let's get out this one first and look at that. So that is a uh, some some dyed milk um, splashing against glass with UV light underneath. You can see the fracture hanging system is pretty simple. You just put a screw in the wall and then hang it up. And you look at this. I mean, it's it's printed directly onto the glass. Let's actually uh, lift, as the instructions say. When you open this, that image, it's its not underneath the glass. That image is printed directly onto the glass, which is really cool. So that one looks pretty good, I think. Um, there's an ad for more fracture stuff. Um, here was a popular one. So this is a, um, a, a beach walkway being refracted through a glass sphere. So we've got a picture of a glass sphere being printed on glass. And there's a hand holding it, and I'm holding the... Um, the picture, you can see how nice and reflective it is because it's printed directly on the glass. And then lastly, we ordered a couple copies of this one. So this is a uh, time-lapse photo of a match being struck. So you can see the friction marks there, and you can see how quickly the hand is moving compared to the one that's standing still. So uh, these are pretty cool. Um, we're going to be hanging these up um, in, I think, probably Pinnacoff... 125 or maybe 226 or something I'm not sure and then we'll hang up the other set in the division office so you can look forward to that here at Jacksonville University